Hey everyone, it's Graphic Pack with another video, and today we're going to be talking about passive XP versus active XP. And here we have the passive XP overnight. I uh, had it doing the primitive wild men for 8 hours and 28 minutes, and I got about 13,852 XP. A little bit of gold as well. The gold, though, is not a big deal. It's not very much at all. I want to say, though, this is about 1,629 XP per hour. That's not too, too bad when you're not playing the game at all. However, I want to compare it up to active XP when you're actually attacking how much more XP are you going to get per hour. So we're going to do exactly that math here right now. Now to get a decent example, we're actually going to go kill these bears. They're level 22. Uh, these primitive wild men that we are killing uh, passively are level 25. So it should be a decently close XP. We actually can't attack these because they are only passively attacked, attackable, I should say the wild men that is so let's go to the bears let's attack here and let's see how much xp per hour we would be getting so this is pretty hard to believe you're actually getting 468 xp per kill when you are killing each and every bear this is going on average if you kill three bears in one minute going to give you 1404 xp per minute which is insane the XP per hour you're going to be getting with the passive way to train is going to be 10 per kill and 1,629 XP per hour. So if we actually take that 1,404 XP per minute and times it by 60, to, you'd be looking at just barely over 84,000 XP per hour versus the 1,629 XP per hour you're going to be getting passively. This is a huge boost and it's going to make passive XP only worth doing as literally when you cannot play play. Uh, passive XP, if you can just sit in hostile zones, is going to be much, much stronger and much, much better XP than just sitting in these passive areas. So the first thing to note here is the wild men are level 25 and the bears are level 22. These bears are level 22, so I do have to use a potion every once in a while to make sure I get the kill. And you guys saw when I logged in after 8 hours and 28 minutes with the wild men, I only gained 13,852 XP and really like 13 silver. So this is a massive upgrade to continue to attack and stay active in a game like this. The passive ability to train while you're sleeping is nice, but it's very, very, very restricted in leveling. It's not much XP at all. And I do highly suggest, if you can, to go into a hostile area and make sure to AFK in those instead while you can be semi-active making sure you're not logging out and things like that but yeah this is crazy to see uh, I knew passive XP was pretty bad but I didn't know the length of it and this is actually a good thing as well in my opinion because you're not going to have people just passively playing the game only uh, you still can but you aren't going to be rewarded for it which I think is a good thing you should be rewarded for your time and so I do like the overall outcome of this I just wish Passive XP was maybe just a little better, maybe two exit, but this is crazy numbers to actually look at, and uh, I'm sure a lot of you guys have some eye-opening moments here as well. So thank you guys again for tuning in. Hopefully this was helpful for you guys, and uh, I'll see you all in the next one.